What is up, boys? All right, so we, I went to Target, or actually Walmart, I should say, and I found a couple of these blisters. I found more Light of Destruction. I found three Light of Destruction, or I bought three Light of Destruction. There were a lot more, actually, so I was very, very pleasantly, pleasantly surprised. And then I only found one Rage of the Abyss, so we'll save that for the, the, the last part of this. But tokens, bro, look at these tokens. These are, like, one of the coolest tokens. They're all protagonist. Uh, we got Yugi, Jaden, uh, Yusei. Uh, I forgot that dude's name. I don't know that dude's name, and I definitely don't know that dude's name. But, uh, oh, man, let's start off with Light of Destruction because we have more of these, right? And I, I do plan on buying some more Rage of the Abyss, uh, you know, special edition of those mini boxes. Not because Rage of the Abyss has value necessarily because it's, it's uh, very hard to get value back from that set. But because of the tokens, the tokens really do do make me want to buy more of that special edition so yes all right so four light of destruction per mini box let's do this we're still trying to hunt for that honest we got a Mir miracle flipper spell gear gladiator lash lucky cha change or chance chance vanquishing light super rare hell yeah we're not guaranteed a super rare hollow so that's decent we can get alties we can get uh the Ghost Rare, which I think I mentioned already, uh, and Secret Rares in this set. So those are going to be the the higher... Oh, well, there we go. All T, and that is... I mean, this is one of I wanted, personally. Destiny and Dragoon. Hell yeah, boys. This is this is a really nice pull. They, it still has those pro the problems. I don't remember this problem being... Uh, I, I, the case back in the day, but these newer alties at least have these print lines on the back. Now, I'm not saying it's like a terrible thing because they all basically have that. And uh, let me see if I can get it on camera for you guys. There we go. But uh, it's it's just annoying more than anything. But yeah, Destiny and Dragoon, let's freaking go. I've been pulling a lot. I pulled two alties. So I want to say a lot, but I've been pulling more Light Sworn cards and i'm not a fan of light sworn so seeing one of the chads uh is, is definitely awesome here hero hero blast rare golden bamboo sword okay all right last pack in this little mini box we got uh arcana force three the mice of the land and a golden ladybug this pack this mini box was pretty decent actually all right boys third or second mini box let's see if we get another ulti, these mini boxes, the pull rates are pretty decent. I ain't, I ain't even gonna lie, this one in the retro pack, really good. So if you see them in the retail stores, pick them up. My opinion, at least. Miracle Flipper, some more Bird of Ancestry. It's also kind of funny because they they did the retro pack. They printed the retro pack in a in a booster box as a booster box, I should say. And I saw some videos of pull rates suck. Some of them in common. I don't know why, though. Uh, Ribbon of Rebirth, why why the pull rates are so weird. Um, you know, boxes, way better. And then you have the booster boxes, which are terrible. And people were selling that box for, like, almost $200 at a point. As people stopped buying them because they saw the pull rates sucked. Glorious Illusion Rare. All right, so we've been pulling nothing but rares. Unifrog. Last pack here. Let's uh, let's end this mini box here with a good, good hollow. We got uh, summon limit. Ooh, you know I, I was uh, hyping this set up or the uh, mini boxes, and we got nothing but rares in that one. All right, last light of destruction mini box. Let's do it. Yeah, honest, bro. I, I would I would also settle for a secret rare honest. I, uh, I pulled that as a kid, too. Volcanic Queen. I still have it. That's one of the cards I actually still have from... Oh, well, another ulti. There we go. Sol Solar Recharge. Uh, There's another uh, Light Swan card. There, I mean, there are a lot of Light Swan cards, so it's bound to happen. But, uh, hell yeah, let's go. See, that's what I mean, man. In, in, a, in a booster box, you can maybe... I think it, it might be guaranteed one, one ulti. And uh, one secret rare, maybe two secret rares, I forgot. But these boxes, man, $14. And it seems like these altis are pretty... They're handing out these these altis like candy. 
Jinzo Returner Rare. Nice. You know, there's a rare in here that I haven't pulled, and it's that one frog dude. Uh, I wonder if he can also be an ulti, because that would be pretty dope. I, I, I don't think so. I don't think so, though. Uh, Dread Servant, Volcanic Queen, Nimble Musabi Rare. All right. All right, all right. Last pack here. All right, man. I, I need that Ghost Rare. Miracle Flipper, Spell Gears, Hero Mask, The Moon. Ooh. I think it was a rare here. Owner Seal Butt. Uh, I mean, not, not ending it necessarily because we still got Rage of the Abyss here. All right, Rage of the Abyss. Let's go. Token, please. Jaden Token. And it is, oh, you say. All right, so let's take a look at this token, though, because it looks kind of plain. I wonder where this came from. This you say card can be used as any token. Let's wrap it up. The Yu-Gi-Oh! card game celebrates the 25th anniversary anniversary in 2024. Thank you, Duelist. Going fast makes you feel alive. All right, they're promoting some drug usage there. I'm just kidding, I'm kidding. All right, so... I guess, yeah, it's for the 25th anniversary. He has the Crimson Dragon in the background. That's pretty dope. I I guess that's original tokens, not from the not imported from the um from the OCG. But I uh, could be wrong here. So Xyz, uh Poseidon Splash, Chaos Allure, Flipping Feline. It, it sounds like they're they're swearing, like this flipping feline over here. Insect Invitation, Fiend Smith, uh like Num Day or something like that. Zoa the Fiendish Smith. All right, all right. Oh man, we need that uh, Mimigool. You know, I've, I've also given up try, uh, trying to pull a QCR from these boxes because I don't think that's ever going to happen for me. Guild to the Sinful Spoils, a giant Mimigool, secret rare. I mean, I think this is 10 bucks currently, so uh, it's not bad. It's not bad, but. Uh, it ain't that one Mimigool dude. Like $150 for that guy, man. Token, token support. <laughs> oh man, that artwork. Reincarnation unveiling mail. Unveiling mail. Okay. Number C32, Shark Drake Levice. Nice. Okay. And then last pack here. I definitely am going to be picking up more of these, though, for the tokens. For the tokens, of course. Armored Shark, Goblin Biker, uh, QQ. Oh, we got a Super Rare Firestorms over over Atlantis, unfortunately. Ending it with a Super Rare, but at least we got a, a Secret Rare in the form of Giant, Mimigool, and oh my god, these ultis, bro. Like, that's that's really what stole the show. There were more boxes, so I might visit that, uh, that Walmart again and um, scoop them up. But that is the video, guys. Catch you in the next one. Big thank you to the channel members, Eric Moreno and Burn My Dread. You guys rock.